Hello friends, greetings from Iceland. We are on the summit of Little Hrutur. Uh, it's uh, 20 minutes to 10 o'clock in the evening. And this is how it looks. Quite many people on the hill in the, in the evening. A bit less now. Many left home already, but still quite a few. And this is the volcano today. Let's zoom into the crater. Seven times zoom, eleven times zoom, twenty times zoom. It got so much shallower comparing to what it was four days ago when I was here. Very shallow. You remember it was really overflowing with lava when I was here the last time four days ago but now it's like half of what it was but still kicking out like trying to to make living you know the last gasps or I don't know I don't want to predict anything when it will end or how it will go but it doesn't look very promising for now but though it might last like this for months, nobody really knows, nobody knows. We had an option here in Reykjanes when lava flooded 250 square kilometers. So, when they say that the eruptions on Reykjanes are rather short, not all. They can be massive. Thrain's shoulder is a good example. The shield of Thrain, which is right next to him. In also 2021, volcano showed very different behavior. You know, it was slowing down, switching off completely, then the re-erupting after one month, and we have seen it so many times. So let's say we don't know when it will end. Simply as that. Beautiful shots in between, like when lava is shooting up. See how many people are here. Now we have clouds coming over in between. That is not fog, those are clouds, low clouds. They can be very low in Iceland. <sighs> Iceland has perhaps the lowest clouds on the planet. They can stay so close to, to the surface of Earth here. And they can be quite dense. So we are right now in heaven <laughs> in the clouds. Which is uh, chilly, a bit chilly to be honest. Stamina is showing you the atmosphere here on the top of the mountain, the people so they could get a sense of what is going on here. Not just the volcano, but also how close the humans can be to the volcano and see it. That is not really an untouchable thing. You could, at least in Iceland, you can approach it and watch it from the hill, <laughs> from 500 meters away, as you see. It's a spectacular hike to get here. I love those hikes hiking trails, like walking through those mountains in the night, it's so cool. Like, 
putting yourself a little bit on the edge of your capabilities is good. Challenges are good for your body. So, I am training us. Wow, there is a hot lava spilling over there, behind. You see? Unbelievable. It's about a kilometer from volcano. So it's like, this is uh, the hottest, the furthest away hot lava that I see. Uh, like, maybe I'll, I will fly drone and I will zoom. All the best to you.